Hey y'all, what's up? It's Jessica. Welcome back. Thank you guys so much for tuning in today. Today I have a super exciting video for you guys. I partnered with Ipsy and Ulta Beauty for their Meaning of Beauty campaign that I happen to be a part of and I'm so excited for this campaign. I'm glad to be a part of it and to share with you guys the possibilities that Ulta has. They have endless possibilities when it comes to beauty. This campaign means so much to me because obviously I love beauty and for me beauty isn't just a thing, it's a feeling. It's something you feel first and and then it just translates to who you are. So you feel it first, and then you are beauty. You are beautiful. So that's why I love this campaign and be able to share it with you guys. And if you go in store to Ulta Beauty, you might even see a familiar face. Today, I'm going to be sharing with you guys one of Fall's hottest makeup trends, which is the High Shine Lip. I did some splurging at Ulta. All of these products are available at Ulta, and I'm gonna share with you guys some of the most beautiful, gorgeous High Shine Lips. You guys know how I feel about lip products, so if you watch my channel, I know you're a lip junkie too, so let's just give ourselves just everything right now. Let's dive into this video. This is the Urban Decay Hi-Fi Shine Ultra Cushion Lip Gloss. That is a mouthful. <laughs> And I already own a few of these, but we have some really gorgeous new shades. Do you guys see this? First of all, purple. I think purple is a thing, because look. <laughs> so we're gonna try on this shade first. This one is in the shade Ghosted, and it's this really gorgeous, like frosty, see those specks in there? Frosty purple. And I'm seeing a whole bunch of like different reflexes in it and a lot of glitter and you guys know I live for that. These have like a holographic finish so if you're into that life you're gonna love these. They're also, they retail for $20 and they're limited edition so you don't want to miss out. So get your hands on these guys. I'm telling you you're gonna love this for fall, transitioning into winter, maybe even throughout the year like me. So we're gonna try Ghosted. Let's put her on. Okay, so she's very subtle. I started off with the most subtle color, but as you can see, there is some, ooh. <laughs> okay, so this is definitely for the girl who wants a gloss, but not like the basic gloss, like your basic, but not basic. It feels really good. It has like this minty feel, so it's definitely going to like moisturize your lips. Mmm. Yeah, she's really cute. I like this for like an everyday gloss with just something special to it because there's glitter all on my lips and I love it. The next shade I'm gonna try is Aphrodisiac. This is definitely an upgrade from Ghosted. So she has a little bit more pigment to her just looking out of the tube. Let's try her on and see. Oh yeah, she's more like iridescent. Look at that guys. I don't know what it is about these lip glosses. They just take like the whole high shine holographic lip gloss, ups your lip gloss game. No more of those basic clear lip glosses. Let's add some shine, some glitter to make it pop so it's not so boring. And what I love about it, you can add more, girl. Just keep powder on until you get tired. <laughs> this is aphrodisiac on the lips. And she's so gorgeous. Like, who needs a lip product underneath? You don't, you can just wear this on its own. Okay, so lastly, we have Tongue Tied. And look at how gorgeous this color is. Look at this purple, guys. Did you get your life yet? Because I did. Oh yeah, she is. That's really gorgeous. It's like the right amount of pigment for the girl who still wants to be like, lit but kind of on the subtle side i really like this all right that is tongue tied she's really gorgeous guys i think out of all of them i like her turn her around or go there she goes <laughs> i like her the best she's really pretty come on purple up next we have the mac grand illusion glossy lip and first of all this collection is everything i wear one of the shades from this collection like all the time. They're metallic and they have pearl pigments in them so they're gonna give you high shine. Um, it has a refreshing feeling, much like the Urban Decay um, lip product. And it's gonna give you that tingling sensation which makes your lip, your lips super like plumped, refreshed. It doesn't feel stiff, just feels like really moisturized good lips. And you want that with your lip gloss. You don't want your lips to feel like stale, dry, or crusty. We don't want that. <laughs> and they retail for $21. So not that expensive and they're gorgeous. Let me just try a few on. Up first, we're going to try out Party Sparkle. 
Her name is fun. She looks fun in the tube. It's like this gorgeous pink iridescent shade. Let's try her on, guys. Oh, one swipe. One swipe and I don't know what to do with myself. She is pretty. Okay, yeah, she's really gorgeous. It's this. Fr it's like a frosty pink, but I don't feel like it's too frosty that I can't wear it. That is really pretty. Like, you have to hit the lights. When you wear this, you find the light, guys. The light is here. It feels good on the lips. It's really pretty. You don't have to wear a liner with it, but if you wanted to, you definitely could use a liner. Just like, I would probably line my lips a little bit, maybe with like a, a darker shade, just a hint darker. But other than that, she's cute. And I would use her like as a lip topper for like a, a pink that I wouldn't wear on its own. Definitely put her on top. But this is Party Sparkle. Is it Party Sparkle? Party Sparkle. Next, we're going to try on Just Hustlin. I feel like this one is a is like a pearlized lavender color. So a little less pink than the one we just tried on. Oh yes. That is really pretty, you guys. Okay. I'm feeling this one a lot. <laughs> I think it's so gorgeous. I really like this one. I think I like this shade a little bit better than the other one. Clearly, I love purple. And I think this one gives me the right amount of purple. She's not too dark, but she's not too frosted. Like, I definitely could wear this on its own and it'd be just all right. This is like my go-to summer lip. I just think a high shine, iridescent, holographic, pearlized lip is year round gorgeous. And this one is giving me so much life. It feels really good. Like even after swatching so many lips so far, lip products so far, I don't feel like my lips are just about to fall off. They feel really good and it's really just pretty. I really like this. And it's soft enough to wear in the daytime, but she's edgy enough to like wear her at night. All right, so this is just hustling. Now I'm going to try Ruby Princess. I'm already loving her. Already loving her. Let's come through Ruby Princess. Yes, yes, and more yeses. Guys, look at, wait, look. Look at this. I want to stop, but there's more colors. But she's like gorgeous. <laughs> I really love this shade. You know, I have like brown lips. My lips are kind of brown and dark. So a lot of times like pigmented lip glosses don't really show up on my lip. I have to add like layers and layers upon layers or I just have to wear like a lipstick underneath to, to get the, the pigment to show on me to bring it out. I didn't need that with this. Like I, I'm here, all the way here for this because I want, I want glosses that show up on my lips too. Like I do and this one does and it's so pretty. Like very subtle, but then not subtle. All right, this is Ruby Princess. Up next we have It's Just Candy, and she does look like candy apples. <laughs> it's like this really gorgeous pearlized red. Let's see how she plays on the lips. Ooh. I really like that. I think this is really cute, especially for those days where like you want a subtle red lip, you don't want to wear a matte lip, you don't want to wear like a, a satin lip, you want like a glossy red. And I think this is a perfect glossy red because it does give you just the right amount of pigment um, so that you can see it, it shows up on your lips, but it's so like subtle in the same way. And I would wear this, totally wear this at night. And this is, it's just candy. All right, lastly, I'm going to try Autumn Russet and it's this gorgeous copper color. And I think a lot of you guys are gonna like this because I'm already liking it. Oh yeah. I'm just like literally here for how pigmented all of these lip products are. Okay, she's really gorgeous. I totally would wear this, but I would line her with like a, maybe like a dark brown just to make it pop a little bit more but she's totally gorgeous. I think this is a really cute like nude lip gloss. It feels good, the pigment is amazing, and I would totally recommend this shade. All right, that's Autumn Russet. 
finally, I'm going to be trying out these new lippies by Ulta Beauty. This is their Pantent Shine Liquid Lipsticks and I'm so excited to play with these. These are exclusive to Ulta Beauty. The formula is very creamy, hydrating, and they give you that high shine that we're all about today. All right, so let's go ahead and try these out. First, we're going to test out Venice. It's a really cute, like, mauve pink. Let's put her on. Ooh, I love the way this applies. So this is infused with mango butter. And as you can tell, when I'm putting it on, it spreads, like, evenly. It spreads nicely across the lip. It's extremely hydrating. And it's super pigmented. Ooh, that's a really pretty color. Yeah, I love the way these apply. They're super smooth on the lip. And you don't get like that, that patchy, you know how sometimes like pigmented lip glosses go on patchy? This one does not at all. Look at that guys. And do you see the shine? Pigment, shine, even application. All right, this is Venice. She's really pretty. Up next we have Pompeii and I am already digging this shade. So this is a nude, but it's more of a, it has more of like a, a darker mauve. So the other one was like a pinky one. This one is more of like a brown mauve. Oh yes, ma'am. So this is definitely a really gorgeous like nude for fall. Guys, I can't rave enough about how smooth and even these apply. Like it feels like butter when you put them on. And even like when you like, you know, you do this motion. Look, nothing separates. That's crazy. <laughs> All right, this is Pompeii. Up next, we have Granada. Let's put her on. Ooh, she's really gorgeous. Smell, yeah, it definitely smells like mango. I love this color. I think it's really cute. I think this is a good nude that I would wear a liner with because I would want something just a little bit on the outline right here to be a little bit darker to contrast. But other than that, I think this is a gorgeous color. She's giving me pumpkin spice latte. <laughs> That's what this shade is giving me. This is like perfect fall, like a perfect fall shade. So that is Granada. Up next, we have Ibiza and she's a corally pink. One swipe, ladies and gentlemen. That. I'm just impressed with how pigmented these are and super like hydrating on the lips like your lips feel moisturized she just I keep looking at it because I'm just like what is this lip gloss <laughs> yeah a gorgeous shade I love her on her own like she can just stand alone she doesn't really need a lip liner Ibiza ladies and gentlemen up next we have Marbella look at that this is a lip gloss, guys. Okay, like it's hard to believe this is a lip gloss. I've tried a lot of lip glosses in my life. And this one is like top two, top two. Look at that, this is a lip gloss, guys. Like my lips, look at how moisturized my lips look. It's insane, it's insane that I'm getting this much pigment from a lip gloss. This is, yeah, this is the fall pink. She's cute. This is Marbella. Up next, we have Milan. She is a cool toned red. So let's put her on. See how gorgeous these are? Okay, so for all of you guys who swear you do not like liquid lipsticks because of, you know, they dry your lips out, they don't apply right, they don't apply evenly, you get your liquid lipstick fix in this plus a gloss. So this is like the best of both worlds. You're definitely gonna love this for all of those who just swear, like you just can't do liquid lipsticks, you definitely have to try this one out. And another thing that I find with some liquid lipsticks is even if you don't want the matte look, like you want something on top, like a gloss, sometimes the formula of that whatever gloss you use placed on top of that liquid lipstick can kind of make the liquid lipstick like shift or move around. It starts to crumble. It doesn't like stay put. So when you use this and you get best, you get the best of both worlds, like you get the stain power, you get the gloss, you get that nice even finish all in one. You guys look at this red lip. Like I am all the way here for this. This is such a gorgeous red, perfect for fall. This is Milan. Lastly, guys, we have Bordeaux. And this is like the, if fall was a color, it'd be this shade right here. Everyone loves a dark red lip for fall. Yeah, I think this is a very cute, like dark red. It's not so bold that it's like extreme, 
but it's dark enough to give you like that subtle sexy look which I love and the shine just definitely amplifies the lip color like it just takes it up a notch all right that is Bordeaux all right, you guys, that is fall's hottest high shine lip trends. Luckily, my lips didn't even fall out. So that's how you know <laughs> these products are really good. Thank you so much, Ipsy and Ulta Beauty, for partnering with me for this video. Um, I can't wait to see you guys' li your lip looks, so make sure like you tag me in your photos, send me your DMs. Can't wait to see you. Be sure to check out your girl in the Ulta store. Again, make sure you guys are subscribed to my channel so you don't miss out on any more videos, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.